My name is Thijs van Rens. I'm the director of the PhD program here at Warwick. So the PhD program at Warwick is, is a little bit different from other programs, especially in the UK or elsewhere in Europe. Um, we have organized our PhD program much more like US schools uh, do, which means that we'll uh, start with a very intensive course work period. In the first two years you'll basically be studying modules. And then there is another um, two to four years of research, which makes the program in total up to six years. The reason we're doing this is because presumably you're doing a PhD, you'll pursue, you'll, you are pursuing a PhD because you're interested in an academic career. And when you finish and you are actually looking for those jobs, you will be competing with students from other schools who will have a similarly intensive preparation. Economics has become a very technical field, so the first year is basically dedicated to teaching you those methods. In the second year, you'll have a little bit more choice and you can uh, study the topics of your interest in depth. And then in the research part, which is the two to four years after that, you'll be pursuing your own research under the supervision of a, of a, a professor at Warwick. Warwick is one, of the, is one of the very top departments in economics in Europe. Um, and that's of course more true in some fields than in other, but basically we have top faculty in all the main fields, starting from microeconomics, macroeconomics, econometrics, um, development economics, labor economics. Um, we are particularly strong, I would say, in development and labor or applied microeconometrics more generally. Um, but my own field, macroeconomics, uh, we, are a, we are a strong department and we are particularly strong in micro theory, I should mention. And in all those fields, what I mean by strong is that we have faculty that are internationally research active. So people that would uh, routinely travel to other top departments in the world to present their research there and get comments. We routinely invite people in all of those fields from everywhere in the world to present their research and receive our comments. So this is a very demanding PhD program and in return we will treat you well. Um, we provide funding for the majority of our um, MRS and PhD students throughout the program. Um, so starting with the uh, while you're still doing courses and until all the way till you defend your dissertation. Um, we will provide funding to live on, we will provide opportunities for you to teach and earn some extra money, also get some teaching experience. There's lots of opportunities for you to attend conferences, conferences present your papers there, uh, participate in all kinds of, uh, of activities. So this program is basically exclusively meant for people pursuing an academic career. Um, our placement on that market has been dramatically improving in recent years. It's, it, it's always been reasonably good, but now we are really starting to get to placing students in the, in the top schools internationally. Um, last year we placed somebody at the University of Toronto, and we're hoping that this trend will continue as we invest more resources in providing better training and providing better support for our students. Um, so by the time you would um, defend your dissertation, hopefully you will be competing with people from top schools in the US and very few top schools in Europe for the best academic jobs or anywhere in the world. This department is very active as a research department, so we'll offer loads of opportunities for students to be research active um, or active in the field of economics outside of their actual course of study. Um, we have uh, seminars in all the main fields. There is uh, in the order of seven seminars every week here by external speakers who present their research. There's lots of workshops where um, internally faculty and PhD students present research to each other. And of course our PhD students are more than encouraged, they are almost required or expected to participate in those activities. Then there's conferences every summer, there are conferences over the Christmas break, there are conferences here on campus, there are conferences in Venice, there are conferences everywhere else in Europe basically. Um, lots of Warwick professors are very connected so they'll, they'll have colleagues, they'll have co-authors and friends in other schools. Um, so if you're interested in economics, Warwick is the place to be. I don't want to say it's the middle of Europe but we're pretty close to the centre.